Uh, today I'm going to show you a Italian recipe called Vaifolo and it's a recipe for chili sauce and Tongans love to put it on every kind of Tongan meal similar to the way that Americans like to put ketchup on a lot of things that we eat, a lot of meals. So today I'll have two helpers, my son Isaac and my nephew Venna and they will be modeling how we chop up the vegetables and blender them in my little baby food blender. <laughs> Enjoy! What are the what are the ingredients that we are going to be rolling. using today? So we're gonna we'll translate all of them: tomato, tomato, chili, <laughs> what is it? <laughs> chili pepper, <laughs> chili pepper, boy <laughs> poro, garlic, kariki, <laughs> coconut, new. <laughs> And a little salt for seasoning. <laughs> so we threw the onion, the garlic cloves in the hole. Peppers, you just you're just chopping off the very very top of the stem, right? Yeah, that's strong. Yeah. Okay. How many chili peppers do you think we need? Like two. No, I think we need maybe. That's a lot. Maybe eight. What do you think, Vena? Eight. 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 The valu. I pay polo e valu. Good job. Now, Isaac's going to demonstrate how we cut the coconut, and we... Just aim between the eyes. Now you got... Yep, good. Mm -hmm. Alright. <laughs> Scrape. We're scraping the meat out of the coconut. We have a coconut scraper and a bowl here to catch the coconut. Now we have all this lovely coconut shavings and we will squeeze it to squeeze all the coconut milk out of it for our recipe. Okay, so that's one coconut and I'll pour some hot water about it and get all the cream out of there. We don't actually put the coconut shavings in our recipe. We just want the coconut milk. So if you use a can of coconut milk from the shop, that'll work too. Like one can of coconut milk for this recipe will work. I'm Oye Masi Mavena. He's adding some salt. I'm gonna taste it. Give it a little taste test. And we'll see if we need to add something else. Bleh. mixture into one or two empty water bottles and then we can we can save them we don't even keep them in the fridge in Tonga we just keep the bottle of Vipolo on the table for like a week or two actually like the older it gets the more fermented it gets the the yummier it is for some people some people like the taste of fermented Vipolo yeah it's so good so I'm gonna make one for me and one for my neighbor <laughs> Ha, o ator, o fado, deu, falou.